Lots of options out there, one being using radio frequency to help tighten your skin. Joining me now is Dr. Ariz Diane, who is the medical director at Avance Plastic Surgery Institute, also a plastic and reconstructive surgeon. Thank you for your time. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Lots going on, and yes. you're also part of some studies to check out the safety and efficacy of some of this technology. We're going to start with, um, show us what you have here first. Sure. So we just brought a few devices. We have about a dozen different uh, devices for minimally invasive aesthetic technologies. Basically, you know, today people want minimal downtime. Yeah. They want a real result. Um, and they want to avoid large incisions and invasive procedures. So we really focus a lot on those technologies. This is a device, it's a very popular device um, in major cities, New York, Los Angeles, called the Morpheus. Okay. This is a needling device. There's 26 needles that come out at adjustable lengths. And there's energy that goes from the tip of the needle to the face plate. And it tightens skin anywhere from 10 to 20%. So this is a very popular device for facial skin tightening, resurfacing. Um, people really love it. We have great results with this device. This just happens to be another device. This is called the Body FX. Okay. And um, what this device does, so the person that uh, devised this is a, a person named Mishka Krydal. He's a Russian nuclear engineer. He's a genius. And we work very closely designing these devices and coming up with the protocols for studies. And what this is is a bipolar radio frequency device that sucks up the fat. It has a little vacuum on it. Sucks the fat in heats the tissue to reduce the, the fat volume. Yeah. And then at the end of that, once it reach a, re reaches the appropriate temperature, there's a little shock wave called electroporation, which breaks the fat cell wall. So this is really um, a very popular treatment. Wow. It's very controlled and, and has excellent results. Our patients love it. Who's a candidate for these sorts of procedures? Great question. So that's the big, that's the big thing. You have to find the right technology to the right people. Sometimes people say, well, this device didn't work on me. Well, yeah. maybe you weren't the right person for it. Okay. So we spend a lot of time uh, selecting patients carefully because we want to make sure they have a very, they leave happy and they have a great yeah, result. Absolutely. So we, I basically we have three groups of patients. We have the young patients that do, you know, skin care, Botox fillers, and they typically don't go for these devices because these mm -hmm. are more body contouring, face contouring. Okay. And then older patients that are more surgical candidates. So this really hits the middle group, you know, patients that had one or two yeah. kids yeah. Um, in their 40s, 50s, that really surgery would be overkill for them. Right. Not ready for that. Not ready okay. for that. Yeah. We know there are lots of questions out there yeah, and lots of answer. options. He'll be here until 6 o'clock tonight. 858-2222 is the number to call. We'll put the contact information for Avance on our website as well. Dr. Diane, thank, thank you. Thank you. Appreciate thank you for it. having me. Thank you. Uh, temperatures are expected to drop this week, and that could potentially mean more homeless fires. What local fire departments and law enforcement are doing to help prevent those fires, coming up.